So today I'm fitting the fenders and everything on here. And the reason I'm doing this is there was a couple things I watched uh, on that uh, CNC equipment. You know, to line stuff up. Don't bolt the body down except in the back. But I uh, had a little issue here and there. Had to bend some tabs down in there. But all in all, this thing is lining up. I mean, flush across there. And then also, I got to cut that part out. I just drilled a hole for now for my steering box to go through there. But I do believe, looking through this headlight hole... We have a clean path right over to the steering hole, which is uh, good because I didn't know if this was in the right place or not. But there it is, it's looking good. Got a couple fenders on it, stuff like that. And I mean, it's running level. Surprise, these fenders run that level. So that's good. I'll be back when I get a little further. Well, you know it's in there. I got this like nine months ago. Let me get it open. All right, I got it out of the box. I got it all set up right here. This is Prius electric power steering. Okay. So you have this long pipe down to some scrap metal and stuff like that so when you go to turn this let's see really struggling you can't can't pick it up okay but now if you take this uh wire it's hooked to this this is like an ignition on wire here it, it clicked did you hear it click here listen Listen. Hear that little click? Hold on, I'm trying to get the wire to stay on there. Okay. It's on there. Now you do this. Look at that. Oh. It senses the weight. Woohoo! Gotta love that. It feels that weight. One finger. Oh, that's beautiful. Disconnect the wire. Go like this. <clears throat> Can't pick it up. You gotta love that. How does it know? How does it know that it senses what you're doing? It says it feels the strain you're putting on this and then the load on that. Unbelievable. Going in the Jeep. Going right over in there. Thanks for watching the video.